again and welcome back to another video. So if you know anything about me, you know that I do not like to wear pants. Um, I prefer skirts and dresses vastly over pants. And yet, I live in Chicago. We've had some single digit temperature days. And I'm struggling. Now that it's January and the weather is really getting cold, I thought now would be the perfect time to make myself a nice cozy little skirt. Now for this project, I'm going to be using a fabric from the Joanne Platitudes collection, which is what I used for my big pants, um, secret pants video, a la Rachel Maxi, which I will link somewhere. Um, and I love that fabric. It is really comfy. It's very cozy, super soft, easy to work with. So that is what I went with for this skirt too. But I wanted it to be more wintry colors and neutral so that I could pair it with other things. So I chose a nice white and gray plaid fabric, which you'll see whenever the video starts. What's your favorite way to keep warm in the winter while still looking fashionable? Cause mine currently is a space heater under my desk at work. Gotta do what you gotta do, you know? If you like this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you'd like to see more from me and yeah let's get started Okay, so let's talk about what I've done so far. So far I have hemmed the skirt and now I'm working on a French seam for the side seam and the top little bit will remain open so I can get in and out of it. 
Um, if you don't know what a French seam is, they're one of my favorite ways to finish the insides of garments. It's basically you sew them together once with the right sides outward, or the wrong sides together, so that you create, here I'll unpin this one, so that you create a little baby hem, and you flip it so that the right sides are together, and then you do a second hem, and that basically creates a little pocket that your raw edge is hidden in between, and that protects it from fraying and all sorts of other types of wear and tear. So that's where I am on this skirt. And then here are my waistband pieces. I need to sew these across the top, and then I have to decide how I'm going to do this triangle bit that will be in the center front. So my original plan was to gather the skirt in a straight line, but then pins like sew down into the skirt, like past where the gathering line will be. Um, but I don't know how easy that'll be. And then I was going to trim off the excess on the inside and flip this over to cover it. But my backup plan, which is sounding easier and easier as I think about it, is I'm going to just turn this back piece into a flat line and gather down the skirt and sew it onto the waistband as if it were just a plain basic waistband. And then just use this to cover it at the end and flip this flip the edges inwards and finish it like that. I'm not 100% sure which of these I'm going to go with. I'm also considering adding a little bit of embroidery right here. I think that'd be nice. But I don't know if I have thread colors that would look good and I don't know. We'll cross this bridge once we get the French seam of the skirt done and the gathering thread in there. We'll make a call about the waistband.
Okay, so the skirt is totally done. It's wearable. I have a single skirt hook, which I use for my closure, and the sides overlap enough that it's fine that this is open over here. Um, <laughs> this kind of turned out a little wonky. This side is not, it's not very straight. So I was going back and forth on whether or not I was going to embroider it, but now that it's so wonky, I am definitely going to embroider it, and hopefully that will distract from the wonkiness of it. So my plan right now is that I'm going to do a little snowflake design kind of with the center at the point. Um, just because this, the colors of this skirt very wintry and it's really thick and cozy. So I don't think I'll be wearing it any other time besides winter. So snowflake will, won't like prevent me from wearing it at other points. So that's the plan. Alright, well thank you so much for watching this video. Um, I really like how it turned out. It's very warm. I was a little worried about the length at some points, but it ended up working out. And yeah, super happy with it. The middle... Hi, you getting up? The middle... Come here. Come say goodbye with me. Yeah, you're gonna help me with my outro? The middle triangle section is a little bit crooked, but you know, what can you do? Um, also my cat matches my skirt, which I think is a great touch. Don't you? You got anything to say? No? Yeah. Alright. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you would like to see more from me and from Miss Eurydice. And yeah, I hope you have a great rest of your day. Okay, bye! See you, goodbye! Bye from you.